Hi everyone, it's Jojo from Mojo Dojo Plans and it is that time I'm going to be flipping through my 2021 planner, the entire thing. Holy guacamole, like we are at the end of the year and going into new planners and I'm so excited. So I've already taken, so I had my planner split up. I only had six months at a time, but I went ahead and put all the rest so it's all on one set of discs. I just have a random cover. I might change these things later, but for now, I, for simplicity, I just wanted to keep it um, the same to what it was right now. Um, but we're going to flip through both my classic planner and my mini planner because these do mimic each other Um not in like decoration, but at least in like what they included in them. So I'm going to go through my classic. This was my catch all, which, you know, this just had everything in it that I needed for the entire year. Um, like my to do's, my appointments, the kiddo schedule, all that kind of stuff. So we're going to go through here and see, um, maybe I'll get re-inspired. I don't know, by like spreads that I completely forgot about or just, it's always just so much fun to go through and like look at your planner. So if you haven't done that, I highly encourage it. And I highly encourage doing so like a couple years from now because it's just always so much fun, especially if you've forgotten like why you plan. Um, it just makes it really fun. I have to find, I have no clue what happened to my intro pages. I wonder if they're still in, oh, you know what? <laughs> They're still in my other planner. Hold on, let me pull this in. I was like, I'm missing something. <laughs> there they are. To make this planner complete. There's my intro pages. I was like, wait, I'm missing something. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. So going into January, we started off the year with... Disney princesses, which I love this. This was so much fun. Just simple. I think my spreads in my monthly have gotten a little bit more complicated, um, but I really like this one. I need to use the princess stickers again. And then my new year's spread from last year going into 2021. Ooh, I forgot about these like dark florals. Oh, I remember this spread. I love this spread. See, it's just, like, so much fun to go through and, like, look at, like, where your style has changed. Okay, so that's all for January. All for January. Then we're going into February, which I used some Amber Plants Her Day stickers. Super exciting. Ooh, look at that layering. Huh. Oh, these were definitely using some older stickers that... I was not used to using. Oh, this was Nene's birthday spread. Oh, and she turned four and she's about to turn five, you guys. <laughs> Can't handle that. It's just like so much, like, sorry, I'm not, probably not going to talk a lot just because ha I'm having so much fun just like taking it all in. <laughs> Okay, here's March using Amber Plants Her Day stickers again. Ooh, I think these are Live Love Posh florals mixed with the, is it called Just Bloom? I can't remember. There's too many sticker names now. I don't remember a lot. Wow, I don't remember. Ooh, I remember this one, but a good majority of these spreads I do not remember. Oh, my spring break spread. Whoop, whoop. That's my next break, and I'm already looking forward to it. <laughs> I'm already ready for uh, spring break. Using my bestie stickers. Oh, I love this spread. Oh. You guys, I seriously think, like, if you haven't gone through your old planners, do it. Because I literally don't remember a lot of these. <laughs> Oh, this is like an old, old book. This was Floral. It's like the fourth book that came out. I need to go back and use some old stickers again. Ooh, Rainbow. Yes. Yes, Rainbow. All right, we're going to May already. And we stuck with those Rainbow vibes, which I think this is still one of my favorite monthly spreads. I didn't put a lot in it, but I still really like it. And, of course, we use florals. These were back-to-school stickers. 
birthday spread was like elegant dark florals. Okay, we're already in June. Ooh, I forgot about this monthly spread. This color scheme though is fire. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't know if I ever shared with you guys the picture of this, but I did color it in. So originally when I did this spread, it was all just black and white. Um, and then I went through like throughout the week with my markers and I like colored it. So if you scroll back on my Instagram, like quite a while, this is like May, June time. You can see the before picture of when it was just black and white. And then I went in and colored it. So fun. Ugh. Anything with florals is automatically going to be my favorite. Florals and princesses. <laughs> Always. Oh, gosh, we're already in July. What? Fourth of July spread, different vibe, still black, black, blue, and red. Why was I going to say black? Blue and red. Ooh. Ooh. Using older stickers. I really need to go back and use the older stickers because so far those have been my favorite. This is my anniversary. Hollow and purple because our colors were purple and silver. I couldn't find enough hollow stuff to like have hollow be in our wedding. Otherwise it 100% would have been. <laughs> I love this spread. I love this spread. It's seriously just, I love looking back. Ooh, I forgot about this one with the fruits going down the center. I love it. Oh yes these yellow florals with like the gray boxes yes oh, I think I did like an extra spread so that's probably what that is but this was my husband's birthday spread so I did like a superhero spread for him and then I couldn't remember what I think I just like missed something there oh yeah this was like an extra spread so I'm gonna hold this like this boop boop that was an extra spread that I did I guess I put it in there Ooh, I like the circles. I need to start using my circles more. For sure. We're already in August. Holy guacamole. Well, now we're in September. Feels like yesterday. Obviously, I didn't have any to-dos on that Friday, apparently. <laughs> oh, yes. Look at the black just making the color pop. Look at that. Nothing like a black box, man. I love this spread. I'm not a big fan of having like random peeps in my planner, but I freaking love this one. My favorite, I think, of all like the wrong wrong stickers. Favorite. I forgot about this spread. You guys. I love these florals. <laughs> this like literally just like makes me want to like play in stickers some more. Here's my monthly for October. And I did switch using pens. When did I switch pens? I think I switched in October. Yeah, I think I switched in October. I switched to just using um, my, like, Energel pen, but in black. I just like writing with that better lately. I still love my Papermate flare, but I think in my planner, like, see, yeah, I keep switching. I don't know what I want. <laughs> I love this Halloween spread. It's like a non-traditional Halloween spread, but I freaking love it. Florals and Halloween. What what better pair there? I like literally don't remember half of these spreads. But my brain these days has just been like all over the place, so that's probably why. <laughs> With like getting ready to like move into our new house. Oh, this is my extras page for Thanksgiving. So like there's the spread. Love that one. Alright, and then we're in December. So here's my December flip through, which I haven't done the flip through of yet. So here you go. And all the other ones we technically flip through each month, but... So this month, you guys, was rough for my planner. I'm gonna not. I'm not gonna lie. I went through like after the fact and like filled in everything, because it was just such a busy week with um, being at like the house and getting stuff done. 
like I really was not in my planners like at all thankfully like my schedule is pretty much the same each week it was just like little extra appointments that I had to remember but for the most part like <laughs> my planner definitely got forgotten in December but it was just because we were moving and it just like life got crazy I knew I like intended this to be for something but it was just like one of those things where like it was after the fact and I was like well too late now and that is it in my classic oh okay let's look at my mini I'm gonna miss my skinny mini for sure I'm gonna miss her but it'll be okay and I know I started like was this my first year in a skinny mini no it wasn't was it didn't I use a skinny mini last year where is that I think I used a skinny mini last year so I'm like this wasn't my first like rodeo in a skinny mini but I definitely feel like I got the hang of decorating it definitely a lot more simple at the beginning of the year that's for sure all right we're in February started to like realize like I could do stuff down the spine and that made it like 10 billion times more fun <laughs> it's a good way to be in this little planner without having to do like a crazy ton Ooh, this one's pretty I like doing the stuff at the bottom like that that gets cut through 100% gonna miss my skinny mini oh I love those florals so much it's because these are still on mini discs so it's making it like really hard to flip through I think once I get halfway through it'll be a little bit easier I love all of these I'm gonna miss my skinny mini so much but I'm like really ready for a new like a new layout and a new size planner so I'm excited for um, my mini but I am gonna miss this skinny mini I had so much fun in this planner I think this is one of my favorite spreads for sure Oop. it's because they're still on mini discs they're not fitting very well I should have switched to classic <laughs> keep like switching hands because I don't know which hand is gonna help me flip pages easier oh I just loved my skinny mini and again this literally just got thrown in my purse and then I just had it to like double check things or if I remembered something while I was out and about that's usually what I wrote in like the to do things like oh I need to do this but don't forget to do those things I miss a spread. I missed a spread. My bad. Jumping ahead. Use some older stickers. OG glam girl. Yes. <laughs> Neutral. Some like fall vibe spreads. Definitely in my skinny mini I found using the thinner pen worked like 10 billion times better. Halloween okay now it's starting to get hard to flip because we're at the end where these don't fit <laughs> some planny thing stickers uh, I love this I like the look of gray boxes too I feel like gray goes really well with like the lighter toned stickers Thanksgiving and then we're in December I love this one. I think this one's my favorite for December. Pretty sure. I do love this one too, though. The kiddo was sick her entire last week of school, so that was cool. <laughs> I was like, great. There we go. Yeah, I think this one's my favorite. I don't know why. I just really like the look of the packages. It's just like so simple but really pretty and then I think this one's one of my favorites in my classic planner yeah 
I mean, I love all my spreads and it's just so much fun to look at them. Um, so if you have not gone back and looked at your spreads from like the beginning of the year or even like old planners, I highly suggest it because I love doing it and then I love going back like years later and looking again. So definitely make sure you're doing that. Um, I will be doing a flip through of my full memory planner. So make sure to see that and stay tuned for that. But I so hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm so excited for 2022 and I hope you are too. It's going to be a fun year and I can't wait to try some new things in my planners and try new layouts and just all that good stuff. But I so hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I hope I'll see you in my next one. Bye!